Good evening, I'm Prasad and you're watching Kini Flash. Riza Aziz, the stepson of former Prime Minister Najib Abdul Razak, will be charged with money laundering tomorrow. MACC Chief Latifa Khoya told Malaysia Kini that Riza was arrested today and subsequently released on bail. The charge under the Anti-Money Laundering, Anti-Terrorism Financing and Proceeds of Unlawful Activities Act is believed to be in relation to red granite pictures, receiving 1MDB funds. You know the production company behind films such as Wolf of Wall Street and Dumb and Dumber. Parliament witnessed a rather unusual scene today. Najib and Newton Sports Minister Say Sadeh Say Abdul Rahman sitting on the same couch to discuss key issues. Najib called the meeting positive. I think uh, uh, you know it's a positive meeting because uh, I think we both agree that uh, Malaysian politics should uh, rise above. Uh, being very personal, uh, you know, character assassination and so forth. We can disagree on policies and issues and that's where, uh, you know, Malaysian politics should focus more on issues, policies as opposed to attacking somebody's character. One of the key policy issues right now is the government's move to table the amendment to Article 119 of the Federal Constitution Bill to lower the voting age to 18 at Dewan Rakyat. It was tabled by Sayyid Sadiq, so this could give us an idea what the two leaders discuss. Najib told reporters that he had a couple of reservations, but overall he appeared supportive of the government's move. Yeah, my reservation would be, you know, uh, young people at that age generally are very impressionable uh, and they're not really that mature. Uh, uh, secondly, um, that the schools would be uh, uh, you know, a, a battleground for political parties, which is not healthy. Universities are fine, but not schools, I think. So um, those are my two reservations, but uh, 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 we cannot go against the universal trend, which is, you know, most countries have gone down to 18. So I think uh, we will support that, provided there's automatic voter registration. So what would be required to make these changes possible? Here's Election Commission Chief Azhar Azizan Harun to explain. Uh, 18 tahun sebagaimana yang kita tahu uh, perlu meminda perlembagaan persekutuan. Okay. Uh, automatic registration pun perlu sedikit pindaan perlembagaan persekutuan dan uh, pindaan peraturan pilihan raya. Kerana uh, mengikut kerangka sekarang, um, pengundi yang ingin mendaftar perlu memohon untuk mendaftar. Okay. Dia perlu file borang A. Ya, yeah. so uh, peruntukan sebegitu kalau kita nak automatic registration maka peruntukan perkara tersebut perlu dipindah. Members of Parliament broke out in laughter this afternoon as Primary Industries Minister Theresa Akok pulled out Malaysian cocoa products from a bag to promote it in Dewan Rakyat. This is absolutely adorable, so you've got to watch this. Salam sayangi kokoku. Hari ini lembaga kokoh Malaysia ada satu pameran. Dan semua dijemput untuk uh, menikmati coklat yang dihasilkan oleh Malaysia yang mana lebih baik daripada luar negara. Di sini boleh dapat uh, ini ubat gigi buatan koko dan juga sabun buatan koko dan juga coklat buatan koko. Jadi semua dijemput boleh dapat free dan saya berharap yang produk-produk ini boleh diekspor ke Iran, pasaran Iran mungkin pada Layak negara. jadi sales girl lah. Terima kasih. Terima kasih. Uh, speaker, boleh tak saya pamer juga barang-barang airline daripada saya? Di tak boleh. Yang boleh, boleh. Tak boleh. Tak saya ada industri buluh yang saya nak perkenalkan nanti. <laughs> And before we go, the Edge Financial Daily reported yesterday that Amno had sold its 11.09% stake in Media Prima. Reporters quizzed former Amno President Najib on the party's move. This is what he said. Uh, well, it is uh, necessary for Amno to do it. Uh, kita tak ada ini. Anyway, uh, Media Prima dah not within the effective control of UMNO anyway. So, kalau kita ada saham yang minority pun, tak ada makna juga. Because uh, NST has not become very friendly to us anymore. And that's all from me today. For more stories, go to kinetv.com. Please leave a comment, hit like and subscribe. I'm Prasad. Thanks for watching. Good night.